If you're lucky, you may have a water fountain of a frog spitting water into a pond. It's fun, entertaining to look at, and has a relaxing effect. But frogs aren't that special. As long as you're not a complete fool, you're going to appreciate the spectacular fountains modern engineers have designed around the world. So without further ado, let's get to it. Amazing. Number 20, El Alamine Fountain. This fountain, which is a war memorial that opened in 1961 in Sydney, Australia, was inspired from the physical appearance of a dandelion. Each of the bronze brass pipes that are planted onto the central globe are tipped with small nozzled spray heads. This allows water to be ejected out as a very fine sphere-shaped spray that mimics the appearance of dandelion seeds riding through the breeze. The illusion becomes even more convincing with artificial lighting and nighttime scenery. Number 19, Japanese Water Clock. Do you know what a clepsydra is? It's the oldest time measuring instrument ever created. Also known as water clocks, these devices utilize a regulated flow of water to keep track of time, which was useful to time the lengths of speeches thousands of years ago. Water clocks have come a long way since then, as proven by this ingenious Japanese water fountain. You'll find it at Osaka Station City, the shopping and entertainment complex built around Osaka Station in Japan. Not only does it display the time, it also creates artwork with drops of water. Every minute, the fountain displays the time in a digital style format three times and then shows off artistic patterns from floral motifs to musical notations and text. Multiple streams of illuminated water droplets create this carefully controlled pattern that reproduces images stored on a PC. Also in Osaka, you'll find the amazing nine floating fountains. By combining downward artificial lighting and falling water, this fountain looks as if it's floating as the pole in the middle is kept hidden. This effect is of course only achievable at night and the floating fountains are usually turned off during the day. Number 18, Vortex Fountain. Outside the luxurious Seaham Hall Hotel and Spa in Sunderland, Northern England lies Charybdis, a spectacular vortex fountain. High pressure water is pumped inside a transparent acrylic cylinder forming an air core vortex in the center which rises and falls every quarter of an hour. There are loads of different types of sculptures like this, but this one designed by William Pye is one of the largest of its kind. In time, the vortex overflows its container and continues over the edge of the container, suggesting a solid, uncontained block of water. After a while, the pump switches off, the sides become clear again, and the whirlpool inside become calmer and more stable. What's especially cool is its turbulent rope-like effect caused by two rotating and competing currents circulating from the bottom water delivery points. Number 17, Giant Tap Fountain. One particular Aqualand branch in El Puerto del Santa Maria, Spain is home to the Giant Tap Fountain. The illusion of the Giant Tap Fountain is very similar to the nine floating fountains. A central pole is covered by flowing water, with the pole itself channeling the water upward to be spewed back by the floating faucet. As a general disclaimer, floating tap fountains are actually fairly common as creative fountains. In fact, there are at least two more in Spain, one found in Olavenza and another in Santa Galdana, Menorca. Number 16, Metamorphosis Fountain. This rather bizarre modernist kinetic sculpture sits in a large reflecting pool at the Whitehall Corporate Center in Charlotte, North Carolina. Though the face spits out water, it's the mirror sculpture itself that captures people's attention. The 40-layer head is divided into seven-layer groups which rotate individually. This creates an otherworldly effect of a transforming head, with the mirrored surface reflecting the sky which further enhances its uncanny appearance. Number 15, Waterfall Swing. In 2011, creative team Dash 7 Design built a special swing for the World Maker Fair event in Queens, New York. The waterfall swing functions much like the Japanese water clock, except you can interact with this one by swinging and it will respond. Whenever you pass underneath the falling water streams on a swing, the flow of water is stopped by its built-in control system. This creates a liquid water hole which appears rhythmically as the user swings. This effect is amplified when two users alternate swings with each other. While built in Queens, it's not a permanent structure and was promptly dismantled soon after the event. Number 14, Tunnel de las Sorpresas. The park of the reserve is a popular tourist attraction in Lima, Peru, and is home to this famed fountain. Literally translated to the Tunnel of Surprise, it's a path of arcing streams of water illuminated by light which is reflected internally within the streams of water. The visual novelty of the fountain makes it seem like the streams of water are neon lights. It was showcased in 2007 and built with a $13 million budget. Number 13, La Jute Fire Fountain. 
This fountain, which was commissioned in 1969, is an ensemble of bronze sculptures that surrounds a central base. The fountain's mechanism operates on a regular schedule. At the start, the fountain forms a mist of water, which eventually turns into dribbles after several minutes. Natural gas is then released systematically and is ignited. This creates a ring of fire that follows the direct path of the surrounding bronze sculptures. Number 12. Dubai Fountain this fountain is the world's largest choreographed fountain system located on the artificial Burj Khalifa Lake. A series of water sprays are arranged in many different patterns, each being adjustable according to how the fountains are set to move. During standard live performances, the entire system settings are choreographed, allowing visitors to witness water jets literally dance. This awe-inspiring display is amplified further with a dazzling array of over 6,000 lights, making night fountain shows one of the most regularly anticipated events in the Dubai Mall. Number 11. Contemplative Court Fountain The Smithsonian's National Museum of African American History and Culture is home to this fountain, the one and only notable indoor fountain on this list. Design-wise, the fountain has a simple layout where water flows down from the sides of a hole in the roof to a square water basin below. Precisely due to its indoor design, the fountain utilizes sunlight as a dramatic lighting source, giving the illusion that the water streams are actually flowing beams of light. Number 10. Trevi Fountain This is perhaps the most famous landmark of modern Rome, in part due to the numerous films it's appeared in. Built in 1762, it doesn't showcase any amazing mechanical gimmicks, but its design alone is grand enough to make this list. It's a breathtaking spectacle of highly detailed Baroque sculptures over a water basin and formation of water jets. Coins are frequently thrown into the water basin for good luck, totaling an estimated 3,000 euros or $3,500 per day. In the past, this money has been used to subsidize a supermarket for Rome's needy. Number 9. Bellagio Hotel Fountains While not as large as Dubai Fountain, the fountains of the Bellagio Hotel in Las Vegas are just as spectacular. Thematically similar, the fountains also showcase an array of dancing water jets and dazzling lights lined horizontally at the front of the Bellagio Hotel's artificial pool. As the hotel describes, it's a spectacular show of thoughtfully interwoven water, music, and light designed to mesmerize its admirers. This amazing fountain can be seen in action regularly each day during its show schedules, which lasts for about 30 minutes each session. Number 8. Jai Du Fountain during the late 19th century, engineers in Switzerland constructed the Jai Du as a safety valve, initially built for a hydraulic power network. It was moved to its current location five years after its construction and is now a famous landmark in Geneva. The Jai Du is capable of shooting jets of water at 200 kilometers per hour, meaning that at any given moment there are about 7,000 liters of water in the air. The highest water jet record for this fountain is 140 meters, which is almost half the height of the Eiffel Tower. Number 7. King Fahd's Fountain Located in Jeddah, Saudi Arabia, this fountain is another incredibly powerful water jet, inspired by the previous example in Switzerland. It's currently the tallest water fountain in the world in terms of water jet height. During operation, it shoots roughly 16,000 liters of water into the air at speeds of around 375 kilometers per hour. At night, you'll see the illuminated water jet spray reach heights of up to 312 meters, or about three Statue of Liberty structures stacked on top of each other. Number 6. Rock Fountain It may sound impossible, but water can make a heavy object like a rock float in the air, and not just via an illusion as with the previous examples. This kinetic sculpture features a moving rock which looks like it's only being supported by jets of water hitting it from below. At first, I assumed it was moving due to some mechanism under the rock, with the water being a gimmick of some sort. But according to some users on Reddit who have seen it, you can push the two-ton rock slightly, so it might be held up purely by the pressure of the water, which is quite amazing. Of course, if the base has been smoothed down, this is entirely possible. Kugel fountains like this exist all around the world, but they typically look like a perfect sphere, which aquaplanes on a thin film of water. This particular fountain's location remains a mystery, but commenters on Reddit suggest it may exist at the Parque de las Ciencias in Granada, Spain. Number 5. Hercules Monument Fountain at the base of the famed Hercules Monument in Germany is a natural-looking fountain that bears a simple waterfall-like design. It cascades downward surrounded by a picturesque view that makes it seem like it's straight out of a Disney movie. Number 4. Moonlight Rainbow Fountain 
The Bonpo Bridge is a major bustling bridge in Seoul, South Korea that connects the Soko and Yangsan districts together. On special occasions, the bridge transforms into the Moonlight Rainbow Fountain, the longest known fountain in the world. It gets that name from its colorful array of 10,000 LED nozzles that light up the jet streams crossing the entire length of the bridge. While it doesn't showcase any artistic structures or dancing water jets, it helps the city boast its eco-friendliness, which ironically means pumping 190 tons of water regularly into the river below. Number 3. The 71 Fountain the now-defunct Columbus office at 1105 Schrock Road, Ohio is the location of a modernist-looking ring structure that also functions as a fountain. The 71 Fountain, as it's named, features water jets that direct water towards its center when it's in operation. This creates a wheel and spoke-like design that forms a mist of water where the jets of water converge. It looks even more amazing with artificial lighting, even during the day, as the mist instead becomes a haze of light. Sadly, the fountain is no longer in operation as the Columbus office office is currently abandoned. Number 2. Swarovski Fountain This instantly noticeable fountain is located at the Swarovski Crystal Worlds attraction near Innsbruck in Austria. Like other fountains before it, this one is more of a spectacle because of its design rather than its fountain gimmicks. The head, which at the base of the fountain is covered in moss that perfectly resembles the grassy hill where it's located, gives off the impression that the head is part of its natural landscape, as if carved from the hill itself. Before I reveal the next example, you should subscribe if you're enjoying the video. We upload amazing fact-filled list videos daily. Also, make sure to click that bell icon to stay updated or you'll regret missing out on some amazing knowledge that could have filled your brain. Now let's get back to it. Number 1. Fountain of Wealth Singapore may be a small country, but it owns the Fountain of Wealth currently the largest water fountain in the world. Built at the heart of Singapore's biggest shopping mall, Suntech City, it has an area of 1,700 square meters and stands at a height of 14 meters. The base of the fountain is adorned by a huge bronze ring supported by four diagonal bronze columns. Water flows downwards and inwards towards the structure's center, diffusing at the bottom as it reaches the floor. The spectacle of this fountain is, like many others previously mentioned, better appreciated with arrays of artificial light. So which fountain did you think was the most amazing? Or do you know of any other fountains that are worthy of being included on this list? Let me know in the comments section down below and thanks for watching.